good morning guys happy monday so today i'm starting off a new weekly vlog i think today it's october 26 2020 and i'm just so excited to start my day with you guys um as you guys saw i made some coffee um usually on any given day i get a cup of coffee i get on the bible app and i start my day off with the word of god kind of just setting myself up for just good energy good spirits faith and stuff like that so i want to talk to you guys about what i am planning to film today so today i was going to do a uh get ready with me kind of like my makeup before i go shoot um something today and i thought that'd be really good because i think i get a lot of questions about like my makeup my skincare routine and stuff like that i also have an unboxing that i uh, want to do i had ordered some things that came in this week when i was um I guess came in last week when I was in Atlanta and I wanted to unbox those things with you guys kind of like a little mini haul it's not a lot I got most of the things from Zara I got a pair of sneakers and some other pieces that I can't think of right now but I wanted to unbox those things with you guys so you guys can see all that I ordered so yeah I'm just going to kind of get my day slowly started with my coffee and kind of um I guess some journaling some meditation and then hopefully i have something more exciting to show you guys okay bye so i've decided to go on a walk this is what i'm wearing you can see all black fit black is very slimming i sweat a lot so i don't really like to wear things of color because i feel like the sweat is very embarrassing so yeah that's why i always wear black so this top is from gap this bra is from i want to say target maybe ross or marshall's these leggings are from Target. They have a pocket on the side. And the most exciting part of my entire outfit is my sneakers. I recently just purchased these for my birthday. They're the hookah sneakers. I remember finding them on um, Outdoor Voices website and being completely obsessed. And that was like, what, three years ago? And I finally got my hands on a pair. Very grateful, very excited. These shoes are absolutely everything. Like, they're so comfortable very 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 chunky but like super cute super super cute i'm gonna give you guys a better view very cute i love them so much i definitely would recommend i feel like black goes with everything so that's why i chose the black color instead of like the super super colorful one but yeah that's what i'm wearing to go for a walk so let's go I am back from my walk and I wanted to sit down with you to do a get ready with me I mentioned in my last vlog that I wanted to do a makeup get ready with me because I Kind of get a lot of questions. Not really a lot. I'm not that popular, but I get questions about my makeup It's very simple I like a very dewy finish and I like to have my cheeks pop because I feel like those are like my biggest Features and people see my face they see my cheeks first So I like to accentuate that and I wanted to sit down to just show you what I do so let's get started. Okay guys, so first I like to start off with my uh, primer, which is my Milk Makeup Hydro Primer. I really like it. This is the sample size. It's really, really cute. And it absorbs my uh, skin tint very easily.
then after that I like to go in with my um, Glossier Generation G skin tint. It's Perfecting Skin Tint in G2. So after foundation, I like to go in with some concealer. I also use the Glossier's concealer. It's the stretch concealer. I have the color Deep. So now that my concealer is on, I'm going to go in with the Glossier Boy Brow in black yes in black and noir now to my favorite part of my whole makeup routine is my blush i use a luminosque powder blush in excite Another favorite of mine is highlighter and I'm using Fenty Beauty's um, Hustla Baby Kilowatt. Okay, and my final step in my makeup routine is my lip gloss and I'm using Fenty Beauty's Fenty Glow. Good morning guys, happy Tuesday. So I am dressed in my little comfy fit because it's kind of cold in LA right now. So I am dressed in my comfy fit and I am gonna go to the grocery store because me and Brandy came back from Atlanta and we don't really have much food. So I need to go grocery shopping. So that's what I'm gonna do today. I don't think I'm going to be doing anything like really exciting, like like actual work today because I got a visit from Mother Nature, girls on her cycle. So I do not want to kind of be bothered. My stomach hurts. It's always awkward your first night on your period because I feel like I'm always tossing and turning and it's really annoying, but it is what it is, like, you know, it's life. But yeah, I just wanted to check in and say good morning to you guys and hope that you guys have an amazing Tuesday. Um, and yeah, this is my outfit. Um, so just to give you more detail about my outfit, this is from Walmart. This is from Walmart. This is a um, tie-dye DIY. I, me and Brandy did it over quarantine. Um, I use bleach and I just ordered this like I said from Walmart these are both men's um, sizing I think a men's large men's extra large I'm not sure and then I have my hookah sneakers I think these are really really cute I'm thinking about doing a styling video on how to style my hookahs with actual outfits that I wear out so let me know if you guys would be interested in that but yeah I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you soon bye <laughs> So this is the Suja Organic Digestion Shot with Ginger and Probiotics. Okay. Just so y'all know. You have to cheers it. I know I'm kidding down at like all like one. I'm gonna time. try. I'm gonna try. Cheers. Cheers. <sighs> not bad. Not bad at all. I kind of would burn more. I think it needs like more cayenne, but it's just ginger. Okay, that was really not good. Bad. Yeah, because really normally good. I feel so sick like after I have shots. 
Woo! Cheers to health, wealth, success! Yeah, yeah like yes. excellent! Let's go! Hey guys welcome to saturday and happy halloween i don't really celebrate halloween anymore but i just would like to put in some spooky vibes for you um so i'm currently headed to hang out with my friend maria um we're going to the arts district i'm really excited because ever since i've moved to la i haven't really had time to explore because this is like my first time ever living away from my family and it's like hard to like kind of I guess expand without um, getting away from your normal day to day. So I'm like really excited to explore a new part of LA today, the Arts District. I've been to the Arts District before, but I haven't like done anything in the area. So like I'm super excited for it. And yeah, so I'm just gonna take you guys along. I'm also running late, so let me get out of here. So I met up with my friend Maria. Uh -huh. Hi guys. Okay, so she just she's gonna show me around the arts district. She's really good at exploring um LA. So I'm just so excited. So what are we getting into Yay. today? Um I think we're going to definitely hit Earth Cafe. Yes, yes right? we are, yes we are. Um, and then just walk around. There's some really, really cool like wall art. Um so it's gonna be really, really fun. And the weather's really nice today. It is. It's super hot. I'm wearing a fucking leather jacket, you guys. Like I'm so hot in this, but it's okay. Hot. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We're walking back to my parking space right now because I have paranoia that like my parking space isn't technically free and I'm a little bit like scared about it. So we're gonna walk back so kindly. She's walking back <laughs> with me so that I can kind of just make sure so that I'm not like bamboozled when I come back to my car. Yeah. Welcome to the fashion segment of my vlog. So I picked up a couple of items from Zara that I really wanted to use for transitional fall to winter pieces. And um, I'm really excited because I think these uh, items are very trendy. I picked up three pairs of pants and one's a denim and two trousers. And I feel like these items are gonna look really good with my, I guess my existing wardrobe, which is pretty much denim and dress heavy so i'm really excited for these trousers so let's get started so let's start off with the very first pair so i got these brown trousers Wait. these brown trousers they're pleated they're super cute they're very long i'm gonna insert some um i guess trying on clips here but um these are very very nice quality trousers I think they were like 40 it was like between 49 to 60 dollars and um, I really like them because I like that I can um, maybe eventually put a belt with it with the belt loops I like the little fake pocket here these are very like grown woman with a draw of trousers and I really like them I think that I'm gonna have a lot of fun styling this kind of nude brown because I think I like nudes that are kind of in the range 
of nude, not completely nude, so like a brown nude or like just a brown tan color. I really like them. Um, they also have pockets, which I really, really like. I wish I had a matching blazer to go with this because I think that this like little business suit would be really cute to style for Instagram and stuff. So yeah. I really really like them and I'm thinking about doing a little reels video about styling kind of trousers in general so let me know if you guys are interested in that and the next pair of pants that I have is the denim um this is my first ever pair of denim from Zara I usually buy my denim from Madewell because I used to work at Madewell and it was just really easy for me to buy jeans there because obviously I worked there and I knew how to find my size I knew how like the denim worked at Madewell so going to other stores and finding jeans wasn't really on my mind because like I had the source right at my fingertips so this is my first pair and I'm really excited about these because they actually fit me. I got them in a 1432 and they're really really cute and like my favorite part about them is the bottom. Like they have like this kind of rolled up like look to them. Very bell bottomy and I really like them and there's slight stretch to them. I cannot wear denim that doesn't have any stretch. Um, I have thicker thighs and when it's just 100% cotton it is not it for me. I feel really uncomfortable and I feel very like I can't breathe, you know. So I really like the color. I like that it's a dark denim. I don't own any dark denim at all and I think this is really cute. And my last and final pair of pants from Zara are these black trousers that are very similar to the brown but I like them the most because I think the black is very slimming. I like color, I like denim, but I also think that a good pair of black pants can take you so far. Like you can just go and do anything in black. So I feel like having a black set of trousers that are super super nice so yes that was my little mini zara haul i hope you guys enjoyed it and let me know if you guys are interested in seeing me style these in like a reel or an actual video for youtube because i'm definitely planning some kind of more styling videos for youtube because i know that my weekly vlogs are coming um every either sunday or monday so let me know what you guys would like to see from me Hi guys, I wanted to properly end off the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching this week. I cannot wait to show you guys what I'm up to next week because I have some cool stuff coming your way. Um, yeah, so just thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next week. Bye!